Welcome to Talmudic Treasures. Today we're learning Moed Cotton, page 5, which brings up an interesting discussion, that which takes place in synagogues in the middle of Torah reading. We engage in a prayer called a Mishaberach, for Cholim and Cholot. We say a special prayer for men and women who are in need of some form of refua to heal to have some form of a recovery. And the names are often read out loud. And in some places, because there's so many names, unfortunately, of so many people that are sick, we just have the person read the prayer, that individual pauses, and everyone else says the names quietly. And because of that, the prayer goes much quicker and therefore doesn't cause a major disturbance in the prayers. Is there any reason one should not do so? So on today's page, we find that when it comes to someone who has a skin disease called saras, and which the purpose of that, why this person received this punishment back in temple times, is because they spoke Lashon Hara, or they engaged in some type of improper antisocial behavior. And because of that, they were exiled from all three camps. And it was necessary for them to say the words, Tame, Tame, I am impure, I am impure. And one of the reasons for this is to keep people at a far distance so that they also would not become impure by this individual. However, the Talmud tells us there is another significant reason why he makes this statement, and that is so that people should recognize that this person is not doing well, and therefore they should pray on his behalf. And this is actually, therefore, an interesting explanation why it actually would be better when it comes to the service to say that person's name out loud in order that people should know that there is a person specifically that is sick so that you'll be able to pray for that individual. And therefore, it is, although a possibility, that this prayer may take extra time, but if it ends up that people will increase their empathy and compassion and think about the welfare of others, perhaps that's time well spent.